Talk me through that one. How'd you feel in the final minutes? Yeah, it was a bit nerve-wracking. Um, you know, we uh, we let him in the game there in the end there, but um, look, I think that our DNA um, kicked in there towards the end, and the boys dug deep for each other, and you know, we're we're very happy to come away with the win. Was it a game that played out the way you'd hoped? Um, to be fair, I'm not sure, but I just know that you know we had a game plan, and I, you know we we stuck to it up until a few um, parts of the game where we let him in, and. Um, you know, we knew that they were going to come out hard in the second half and try and try and beat us. And you know, they're they're a very uh, gifted team in terms of attack. So uh, we showed there in the end. And um, yeah, but we're just happy we, we we closed off that game. Crowd don't make it any easier here, do they? 100. percent You know, I thought <laughs> Walford Road was loud, but you know, if, uh, you know, it's probably my first experience playing in front of some of these crowds. And you know, uh, Gloucester, the Gloucester crowd really put it on for their team. And you know, like anything else. Um, you know, the only way you, you, you can sort of make them quiet is by, you know, tick, making, uh, ticking the scoreboard over, and I thought we did that tonight. Was that you screaming for the ball out there tonight to get those runs going? Yeah, well, <laughs> you know, uh, I just said, oh, we give the ball and we'll see what we can do on the edge, and, um, yeah, we, we, I'm very happy. Go back home now and take on Sarries. Doesn't get any easier. Yeah, uh, Sarries, you know, they spend a year, they're also in championship, but they're a world-class team. Uh, we saw that last week against Bristol, um, so... You know, they can win away easily. So, you know, we, we've got a few days off now. We'll regroup and, you know, we'll, we'll get ready for uh, Saris. Thanks, mate. Cheers, mate.